this is about, this goes back to what Q and W mean. <laughs> what does Q mean? Q is heat transfer. How do you get heat transfer? You put the thing that you want to transfer heat into, into co something in, con in contact with something that's at a higher temperature. Or you, want, or you put the thing in, con if you want to cool something off, you put it in contact with something that's at a lower temperature. Heat is an energy transfer between things at high temperature into things at low temperature. Is that the energy transfer that happened here? Did this happen? Did thermal energy go down? Because we put something cold in contact with that. And the answer is no. There was nothing cold around. In fact, I didn't tell you about anything else in the universe. There's a hint that the Earth is there because it raised the mass up and so the Earth must be pulling on the mass. But there's nothing, there's no thing that's at a low temperature that cooled that off. So it's work, not heat. It isn't Q that's less than zero, which is what the majority of you said. It's D, it's W that's less than zero. One of the energy trends, you're right, that, I mean, anyone that said something is less than zero, <laughs> certainly delta E thermal, E thermal went down, so delta E thermal is negative, so the sum of those two has to be less than zero. Q, there's no, this didn't happen because of a heat transfer. It happened because of work. You could say the gas did work on the mass in raising it up, so it lost energy in raising it up, and that was the work that happened. Yeah? So the work is being done on the How's the work how's it made it? So so how is it how is work negative? Let me just leave it at this. Delta E thermal is equal to the heat added, Q plus the work added, W. Delta E thermal is negative. No heat was added. That means work, W, the work added, is a negative number because work energy was taken out. 